I wish we'd all been ready. Hello there, friends. Who would you like to teach this lesson? Sylvester Stallone. Or Arnold Schwarzenegger. How about me, Peter Sanchez, a.k.a. The King's Arrow? Anywho, so yes, so that way I don't try to act like I'm a super famous movie star, or that I'm such a good actor. Eh, I might not be that bad, but I may not be that good. So, I'll just leave you to, the, to decide. Anywho, uh, oh yeah, you remember that song I showed you? That's a song called um, I Wish We'd All Been Ready. It was performed by um, DC Talk, but it was um, written by some guy in the 70s. He was one of the first guys um, ever in... Uh, he was kind of one of the first um, Christian contemporary artists. Uh, it was like during like the 70s and stuff, like Jesus movement. Anywho, but uh, the song is called I Wish We'd All Been Ready. So this is how it sounds like with the lyrics added. Life was filled with guns and war And all of us got trampled on the floor I wish we'd all been ready Two men walking up Sorry, I messed it up. Children die, the days grew cold A piece of bread could buy a bag of gold I wish we'd all been ready There's no time to change your mind The sun has come and you've been left behind So yeah, now to the guitar. See, so this will be an extremely easy, um, kind of easy, uh, for your newcomers, this may be, uh, maybe the chord transitions might be a little hard. And uh, afterwards, like... And there may be, there's kind of like a new technique. I don't know what it called, I don't know the professional term of it. I just kind of thought it helped. And then um, also the... And also like, uh, translating from like a melody, for example, to like uh, playing chords. Yeah. I hope this isn't. I probably won't, I'll try not to make this too complex. Anywho, so first it goes D major, G. Wait, no, sorry. D. Then D seven. Then G. Then D A minor. D. Oh, sorry, it's D. So now how to play that. So D is kind of like, uh, it's you take these two fingers right here, and then you place it, um, then you place your middle thing, yeah, sorry, your uh, index finger, place your index finger right here, right here, uh, that's G, that's second fret G string, and then you put your middle finger on second fret um, e string, and then you put your ring finger on third fret B string, and then you strum the bottom four strings. For some reason, I think, oh yeah, I, I taught this in my um, recent tutorial and my second guitar lesson. It was my last video. Anywho, so you go, and for this effect, I put my pinky right here on 3rd fret E string and then when I struck up once then I put my finger down for the second time like this and then let go and 
and this is D7. It's um, a very interesting chord. So, so yeah, D7 is uh, kind of like D, kind of like D major. You take, uh, you see how your fingers would be like right here for your index and uh, middle finger. Well, you want your uh, now you want your um, middle finger and ring finger to take those same places. Ring finger at E string second fret and middle finger at um, G string second fret and index finger on D string first fret. And that's how it sounds. So it's life was filled with guns and war and all of us. And then if you want to know how to do this, well, this is the t uh, next. It's going to go into G major. So, yeah, so what I do is I go E string, let's see here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, wait, 7? 3, 3, yeah, 7. Um, 7th fret. So it's E string 7th fret, E string 5th fret, wait, yeah, E string 5th, sorry, E string 7th, E string 5th, and then E string second fret so it's and I'm making uh, I'm using a you can play regular G but here's how I'm playing it I'm playing a very melodic very melodic G I think it's called maybe but um, you take these two fingers your ring finger and your pinky and you put them on the set on the third fret of both the B and E string. And then you take these, your middle finger, uh, you put your middle finger on third fret, uh, top on the top on the top E string, and then your ring, your sorry, your index finger on um, sorry, uh, A string second fret. Together that makes. So it's kind of like G, but then you use your two fingers to cover both B and E and E string, third fret. So it's life was filled with guns and war, and all of us got trampled on the floor. I wish we'd all been ready. So. Yeah. So then it goes to D. So then it goes back to D, then to A, then to G, then to A. This transition was the hardest for me uh, when I was learning it, because I would always mess up and all that stuff. So yeah. So it may take you a while to learn this as well. So it's D, then A, it's, and it's A major takes these three fingers: index, uh, index finger, middle finger, and ring finger. And then you put that on, you put your ring finger on B string 2nd fret, ring finger, sorry, ring finger on B string 2nd fret, middle finger on uh, G string 2nd fret, and then index finger on um, D string 2nd fret. So now it goes, I wish we'd all been ready to win. So yeah, that's how it works. And, and uh, so, so far we've gotten to, life was filled with guns and war, and all of us got trampled on the floor. I wish we'd all been ready. So yeah, this next part, it's pretty simple. It's, and you repeat this again. Children die. Wait, there's a, let's see here. So, sorry, if, um, I know I was saying this a thousand and one times, but let's start off from the beginning again. Life was filled with guns and war, and all of us got trampled on the floor. I wish we'd all been ready 
Children by the days grew cold a piece of bread. So yeah, and then you repeat this two times. So, and then you go over, and this is the second part. And then it goes, and There's no time to change your mind. The sun has come and you've been left behind. Say it. And this is pretty simple. Say it. And um, the reason why I show you this is so that um, it, should be, it should be pretty easy. Anywho. So now, uh, so it's D. So it's, sorry, so it goes. There's no time, G, to change your mind. D major. Then C major. The sun has come. And you've been left. G major. And C major. B, sorry, D major. Behind. You can also start off the song this way. You don't have to do the individual strings. You can say, Life was filled with guns. Wait, sorry. Life was filled with guns and war. And all of us got trampled on the floor. So, yeah. Anywho, and now to do C, C major. It's pretty, easy. It's pretty simple. Uh, it's, um, let's see, that's. Um, first fret B string. This is second fret G string. Wait, let's see here. Oh, wait, sorry, no, not second fret G string. Second fret D string, and then third fret A string. So yeah, that's how it works. So it's and there's no time to change. Kind of one of those um, famous, kind of classical songs of like recent, like recent, recent. Anywho, um, soon I'm going to be doing a DIY video on how to make this a bottle cap container with two separate compartments or just one compartment optional. And um, I learned this from one of my subscriptions uh, called The King of Random, Grant Thompson, The King of Random. And um, I'll show you how to make this in the next video. Have a nice day, friends. God bless and peace be unto you. Remember, the key to playing in tune is to always, well, the key to playing, to playing nicely is usually tapping your foot. Because, yeah, if you're off tune, if you're off beat, that messes up the entire song. Anywho, have a nice day. God bless.